Look at that Northern Ireland sky, beautiful. I'm walking along the River Lagan here on a pathway towards Lisbon train station to head into Belfast city. Let's go and explore. So the River Lagan actually flows for 53.5 miles, one of the largest rivers in Northern Ireland. It runs from Sleeve Crew Mountain in County Down and flows all the way to Belfast into Belfast Lock. And I'm walking this scenic mile along the river towards Lisbon train station. So this is actually Northern Ireland's third largest city. It received its city status by Queen Elizabeth as part of the Golden Jubilee celebrations. And not much has changed since the 18th century with well-preserved buildings. Time to head to Belfast from the historic train station. So Lisbon train station opened on the 12th of August 1839. This is one of the direct links into Belfast. Let's go. It's a scenic route spotting Colin Mountain and the National Football Stadium out of the window. The final destination is Great Victoria Street, situated in Belfast's premier commercial zone. So I arrived in Belfast city, and I thought it'd be interesting to look at a sort of top five things to see when you come to Belfast. So this is the grade A listed Belfast city hall. Today, it is used as a meeting place for the Belfast city council and other government needs, and you can take a free guided tour of it too. And with the sun starting to dip, there was much more to explore. And we're back by the River Lagan. We've one standout site to spot. Want some Belfast history, but on a barge? Look no further. The 600 tonne barge is an interactive museum that tells the story of Belfast maritime history. And there's a cafe to be enjoyed too. Heading along the river and past the Lagan Weir to look for more. And if you love Game of Thrones, check out these all over Belfast. To celebrate 10 years of filming taking place in Belfast, Tourism Island created six Game of Thrones stained glass windows which depict families, characters and scenes from the TV series. And you can even sit in your own glass throne. And now my walking tour is welcoming some snow. <laughs> Probably the most recognisable sights in the whole of Belfast is the Harland and Wolf Gantry Cranes. Situated on Queen's Island and towering over the Belfast skyline, the cranes were named after the biblical figures Samson and Goliath. On to my final stop. This is Titanic Quarter. Named in recognition of the famous ship being built here, Titanic Quarter is formed of 185 acres of prime waterfront land, with the Titanic Belfast attraction allowing visitors to experience the story through a self-guided tour. And it's incredible to think that here on the Olympic slipway is where the RMS Olympic was built alongside its sister ship, the Titanic. Walking the cobbled streets, there are reminders in all directions of Belfast's incredible maritime history. So much to enjoy in this wonderful city.